Hey guys, what is up? And welcome back to my channel. And if you don't know why I'm, I'm Kay. And you're welcome. <laughs> doing so good welcome back and welcome 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 back <sighs> it's been a long time i did a story time though i'm back home <laughs> but i've been really really busy so today i want to do a story time on should i call it i was no let me say i was abandoned i was abandoned i was depressed my depressing moment in school this is going to be part one my depressed my depressed moment my, yes my depressed moment okay so i'm going to start by start the story of from when i was still in school and i was still at the age of 10 below 10 below so what happened what used to happen then was that time my mommy say whenever i was young when i was younger if she's like i'll just go and do something and i'm like no i'm not going i'll go later then she'll be like don't worry i'll take you away from that your school she'll be the school that you are don't worry then i'll be like oh no 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 i still like my friends there. i love my friends there. i want to go back there then i will quickly do whatever she tells me to do like if she sends me on an errand like go and wash plates bring something for me go and bring my this go and bring my that i'll answer immediately once she can say that sentence so a quick disclaimer i'm cool with everybody in this video um, that i'm about to talk about i'm cool with everybody my friends which were my classmates i'm cool with them we don't have any arguments but i may not be cool with like one to two like one or two and that was like my teacher or something i don't know but i'm very certain i'm not i've never seen her so i don't think anything can drag us together anymore again but i'm cool with everybody i'm cool with my classmates i'm cool with everybody we are not in any argument or any fight again all of us are just cool i just decided to forget about everything so there used to be this girl <laughs> she's certainly going to watch this video there used to be this girl every time it is someone's birthday no not before that she used to like she used to be bossy in class this was around primary to nursery she used to please so i beg now those story are they talk oh, i'm just saying the story i'm not trying to clash or bash anybody and i'm not trying to be mad with anybody or trying to form a story that's not but what i can remember because i don't i have intensive memory once it comes to things that did in my life and any other thing so there was this girl whenever we were in school stuff like that we are just like talking or something we are playing once it's school over when i was on sit with them they be like if this place please don't come and sit down with time blah 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 so there was this certain day on my birthday I wore a yellow gown, a gold shoe, not like a gold shoe, a yellow shoe that looked like gold. They let us throw that shoe in church. So, this girl just like, please come now, come, come, come. My real name is Alice. She's like, Alice, come now. Wow, your face is nice. I love your dress. I love your gown. Thank you, this. I was like, eh? <laughs> okay, no problem. I fashioned it, Sensha. So, after that period, when I moved to, when as years went by went by went by i got to primary six which is also known as common entrance class also basic six basic six primary six common entrance class so hmm, this was when the fire started i used to have this teacher she was our yoga teacher and also my lesson teacher may i so rest in peace she passed away like a few years ago so she was like the only teacher that accepted me for who i was and 
I had two of my friends, which were also in my class, that did not have any argument or any problem with me at that period. And I did an interview with one of them, that's Aisha. You can check the video. I may link it in my description or you just go back and check my videos. So, and this other girl, um, she was also part of, like, we're okay now. Like, we're just, just the three of us in the circle but i still had problems and issues with them but it was not as serious as i had with the rest of my classmates we were 19 in the class except except me we were 18 so with me 19 everybody all together i remember very well so there's this woman in our class we used to have like the teacher at the front then this woman because she was our math teacher she she was our math teacher, so I don't know. Normally, normally a primary school, don't, your class teacher is the one that teaches you all your courses in Nigeria primary schools. I don't know, but I'm talking about my own primary school, and most of the primary schools I've seen before. So this, but she was the one teaching us math and one other. I think basic three or primary three. Or for me too, I don't know. She was teaching some other classes, one other class, so we like two classes. She was teaching math. So this woman was like, because I used to behave somehow. I do not know what happened at that period. Should I say like village people, but not village village people, but village people were like after me during that period. I used to have this strange behavior and stuff like that. So this woman called me out. She was like, um, Alice, I used to behave like this that if you have a problem let me know so we can talk about it we can pray about it she has called me different times but this is the specific one no she only called me once but this is the specific one i remember this is the second time yeah then she was like we can talk about it no problem blah 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 i said okay ma. because in my head i was like you call this small girl to come and tell her if you have a problem come and meet me that i'm going to help you i'll pray for you woman my mother is a prophetess I'm not like okay because my mom is a prophetess blah blah blah. You are just no. Let me know. Just go back. Let me know. Good start. Like. So this woman was like, I said okay man. I was so kind and so humble. I was like okay man, no problem. I'll come and meet you. I started thinking it in my head. Do I actually have a problem? Why do everybody actually like move themselves away from me? Why do I always? behave different i was not like this in primary four to down i i was just like okay no problem then i don't know i, I, I feel like i'm about to start crying <laughs> then when i was done because she sit at the back of the class so when i was done i went to sit down i sat i used to sit alone because of what was happening i sit alone they kept me alone on my seat even my principal hmm that woman eh hmm god 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 really did wonders in my life <laughs> so let me tell you about that woman's part the woman okay what happened was i went to the toilet i i i went to the toilet the restroom and like so i told my class teacher so please excuse me i want to use the toilet so you can go going i went i washed my hand so we're having this literature class where you come out and read comprehensive books comprehension pages then this boy read the book i remember him but i don't want to mention his name i'm cool with everybody and it's also i don't know if he's cool with him but should be, we talked because we did senior work together so this guy was at the door like at the entrance and i just entered and I don't know why, I just sprinkled water on his head. The water I used to wash my hand, I sprinkled it on his head. Then, then they were like, then they were like, the teacher just looked and was, all the, all everybody, the students, even my classmates were not even looking. They, because everybody, they were all on their book. And the teacher and that math teacher now looks like, why did you do that? Then the, Master teacher was like, what, why did you do that for your village? Your people have started again, Abby. Do you want to remove the boy's intelligence? Because the boy is very intelligent. She was like, do you want to remove the me? I don't know. But so the was like, do you want to make the boy dumb? Do you want to this? Do you want to that? I said, no, ma. I don't actually even know why I did it. Because I just did it out of, in my own way, I did it like, 
I was just playing. I didn't even know they were reading. Like everybody was so serious like that in the class. So my principal came later that day. She was like, "Why did you do this like this?" They reported me to her. Like, Why did you behave like this? Blah 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 blah. Then she took me. She now held me on my hand. She's like, "Just dragging me out of the school." She dragged because. The school was like this whole compound is for primary, this whole compound is for secondary, this whole compound is for whatever. And what? <laughs> and that period, our office was in the um, the primary nursery side. So our own class was like the only primary class that was inside the secondary school. So just dragged me out on the road she was like how type of actress you should expel you i don't know why you're like this mother you always here complain about you every single day and i'm like expel what's the mean that was the first time i ever heard the word called expel in my entire life i did not even know what they called expel i was like expel what does it mean i was thinking like maybe like they will kill me or something i was about to start crying because i don't know what was happening to me at that period then she now took me to her office i did not even go to class at all later sha, later on after like let me say like two i don't even think it was two hours and i went back to my class i think my class teacher came to pick me i just don't know how that part happened though it was closing time i don't even know so the part of my math teacher's part no before i get to that part because that that was the last <laughs> oh my god so there was this i used to go to school very late but i don't go very early i don't if i don't really live far from the school at that period until now so i don't still live far from the school so i used to get to school very late but not late but after assembly after assembly i'm always okay yes i'm going to school i've gotten to school so during that period because they were preparing us for common entrance exam which is exam for you to enter gss class to enter junior secondary school class that was when we used to have morning classes we don't even used to do assembly with them open our final steps some others um, schools of i do or do go some i don't know but we used final steps final step so that morning two of my classmates sat down on my bench on my seat where only me sit down i don't remember those classmates but i know two sat down no one sat down i was like okay i just when i came i was like okay i just person do not understand me have you no there were two that sat down on my seat i was like why you put on my seat oh yeah one of you should stand up let me sit down because i don't want to know i lie again because they will start saying i've come again they will expel me blah 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 then the teacher was like can't you just sit down somewhere else no wala just sit down somewhere else let me not so i now sat down beside this girl out of anger i kept my chair i didn't even actually from the bottom of my heart i did not know i moved i hit this girl to the wall but due to the pride and the anger that was in me i could not say sorry then hmm I just kept my chair, my bag on the chair and I moved. I, I just pushed that she's very thin. <laughs> I'm so sorry, but now I'm saying it publicly. I'm so sorry <laughs> about that time, that period, because I'm very sorry she's going to watch the video too. So she goes like uh uh Alice, why do you why do you push me? I'm like I'd never say anything again. Then my teacher, that mass teacher from back myself, why do you always behave like this? You this Alice, blah blah blah. By this time they've already finished assembly. Then my principal entered my class. At least I heard them shouting your name again. Blah blah blah. She had this this thing was not even called cane. It was wood stick directly from the farm that they just shaped into into cane. Hey they shaped it into cane. She went to her office. Now she crossed the road. To go to her office to get that thing to come and beat me she gave me 10 strokes of 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 cane 10 strokes i will never forget it in my life even that woman i will never forget that give me 10 strokes my fingers my my this this palm this place this exact place oh my lord swallow i could not hold my pain i was crying 
till the class was the, till the day was over i was the thing was just in my head i could not even eat because i was on school food when they brought food i said i'm not eating you should carry it and be good i don't want to eat food hmm. i said i don't want to eat food they could not carry and go i did not eat anything i was just thinking about it i was just thinking about like, god what did i ever do i think i have to leave this school she be just taught them that I remain. I think that was even taught them. I was like, oh no, I have to leave. Then my mom, when I got to, my mom was not like, I didn't even tell, I think I told her. But she was like, don't worry about it, you soon leave, blah blah. And I was like, okay. So when she, that, well, the story I said earlier about my mom sent me a message and she be like, I'll remove from the school, she was your school. And when she now said, I was like, see, I'm tired, even remove it from that school, I don't want to school again. I don't want to school again. I started crying. I'm so frustrated. I was like crying. I was crying. My mom was like, What happened to you? Hey, why are you crying? And I explained everything from A to Z. I explained everything step by step for her. She was like, Okay, no problem. Let's not. Let's just close and talk. Yeah, that was where it ended. Then the next day, that was when that my lesson, that my math teacher now called me and was telling me story that if something's wrong with me, I should come and tell her so that she can pray for me. That was when I said, okay, man, I even reason it as okay, maybe she wants to be a mother because she just got married at that period. I now went to sit down on my seat. Though. These two boys at my back, just saying, hey, eh, Alice. Why didn't you see your word? You always misbehave, you always been behaving in class. So, and I turn, I was like, What's your business? And I faced my friends. Do you want to say, Ah, ah, Alice, why do you this? The boys now say, Ma, she is that you. I said, Jesus is Lord. <laughs> I is that the woman. Alice. Alice, Alice, Alice.